At Secure Circle, we help our customers secure business data as it moves to end user devices. By encrypting the data within files as they are written to the endpoint, Secure Circle protects data against modern threats, including external bad actors, malicious insiders, accidental dissemination, and ransomware exfiltration. Secure Circle keeps data encrypted in transit, at rest, and even in use, is completely file type agnostic and transparent to applications, and data within files is always accessible to permitted users, but can be revoked at any time. In this demo, you will see how Secure Circle can be configured to automatically protect data coming out of SaaS applications, such as Salesforce, and protect data persistently even when protected data is moved to cloud storage services or removable media. With Secure Circle, securing SaaS data is simple. In the Administrator Console, we are able to configure data policies, which dictate how data is secured, as well as who is able to access secured data and how. With Secure Circle, access to secured content is limited to only allowed users on allowed devices using allowed processes. To begin securing data, we start with first creating a circle or data policy. Using my configuration as an example, we can see that I have several data policies which pertain to different workflows. For example, securing data coming out of salesforce.com. There are several ways to configure Secure Circle to begin automatically securing data. From the menu, we can expand the Secure Data tab and find that we can secure data by process, by regex, and by URL. We'll focus today on securing data by URL, as this is the method that we will use to demonstrate securing data originating from SaaS applications. Let's select and look at the salesforce.com rule. To accomplish securing Salesforce data, we will use regular expression pattern matching against the source URL of data downloaded from a browser. Here we can see the regular expression pattern that will ensure that all data exported from Secure Circle's internal Salesforce account will be automatically secured as it is exported to the endpoint. We can also see that data that is secured in this way will be secured as part of the salesforce.com circle or data policy. This is an effective method for extending the security of a SaaS application to the endpoint. Once the data has been exported into a file on the endpoint, only allowed users on allowed devices will be able to access the content. Let's see how this works. I'll log into Salesforce to access some reports. Once I've found the report that I want, I'll export it to a CSV. The file is immediately secured on the endpoint because I downloaded it from the Secure Circle Salesforce URL. When I check the properties of this file, I can see that there is a Secure Circle tab which will let me know that this file belongs to the salesforce.com circle based on the rule which was shown earlier. If I attempt to access this data with an unsanctioned process, such as Notepad, we can see that the data is not accessible. However, as an approved user, I am able to access this data through a sanctioned process, such as Excel so that I can work with this data uninhibited. To further protect this data, Secure Circle will prevent unsanctioned clipboard activity between this file and an unsanctioned process. For example, I cannot copy and paste this data into Notepad. However, since Excel is already a sanctioned process, I am able to copy secured content and paste it into a new Excel file. Now, when I save this file, we can see that Secure Circle automatically recognized the similarity of this data to that of previously secured data, 
and therefore automatically secured the contents of the new Excel file, even though it is a new file, and even though it's changed formats from CSV to Excel workbook. Further, if I check the properties of the file and look once again at the Secure Circle tab, I can see that the file was automatically secured as part of the originating file circle, in this case, the Salesforce circle, because the data originally was exported from Salesforce. Finally, we'd like to demonstrate what happens when this file leaves the environment. With Secure Circle, the security of the file persists as it's copied or moved around. The file can be shared in any way without risk of exposure, since the data is secured by default. Again, access to secured content is limited only to allowed users on allowed devices and using allowed processes. So if I shared this file via Dropbox, email, or any other method which would make this file accessible from an unmanaged device, I would not be worried about any type of data leakage. As we'll see, even though this file is now accessible by the recipient, without the Secure Circle agent and without membership into the correct data policy, that recipient is ultimately unable to access the secured contents. Although the original user attempted to make this file available to external users or devices, Secure Circle inherently protected the content, preventing any possible exfiltration. Also, from the Administrator Console, access can be revoked on a per-user basis. If for any reason, access privilege needed to be revoked for the original user, a Secure Circle admin would only need to first search for and find the user in question, and then simply disable the user. Secure Circle would then no longer grant access to any secured content which the user was previously able to across all of their devices. As you can see, Secure Circle helps keep data persistently secure once it moves to endpoints, regardless of where the data originated. Data within files remains secure even when the files are transferred off the endpoints. For more information on securing data on endpoints, visit securecircle.com.